Thousands of Bibb County teachers and staff filled the Macon Centerplex to kick off the new year with a few words of encouragement and a lot of talk about the Macon miracle. 41 NBC's Jasmine Williams tells us what you can expect this school year. I believe in the Macon Miracle. When Bibb County students go back to school this year, the Macon Miracle will be a reality. The 86-page plan that includes alternative school options, additional training, and Chinese courses for elementary students goes into effect immediately. At this year's convocation ceremony, Superintendent Dr. Romaine Dalaman seemed eager to put that plan into action. The Macon Miracle provides the roadmap to guide our efforts. But the road to the Macon Miracle was rocky. The new changes faced opposition from the community and even some board members. Dalimon emphasized he is standing behind his goal to make Bibb County known around the globe. Giving our students the opportunity to speak not only English, but Mandarin Chinese where they can do business with the second largest economy will only place Macon in a better position. The theme for this year's convocation was believing in miracles, a theme Dolly Mon found very fitting for the school system's current circumstances. Despite the controversies, he is firmly standing behind his plan. Do you really believe the making miracle is possible? <laughs> Without hesitation, the answer is a resounding yes. For board member Susan Middleton, the Megan Miracle has been a learning process. Well, it's a broken system, and so you don't just magically change a system. So all of these pieces matter. Starting Monday, Bibb County will put these standards to the test. In Megan, Jasmine Williams, 41, NBC News. During his speech, Dolomon also mentioned that school enrollment and reading proficiency in Bibb County are up. He says he's excited about all the new changes and is looking forward to the future.